all right guys welcome back to another video so here we have a toyota highlander the customer actually uh, had the vehicle at a body shop had some work done and they replaced this side but didn't replace this side uh, it, most insurance companies will not pay for the second headlight for a cosmetic issue if it's hazing up because the headlight still works it just looks pretty bad so as you can see kind of looks like the car is winking at you we get these fairly often we work with a, a few different body shops that always send us customers like this and obviously it's much more efficient to uh, just pay to have it restored rather than actually have it replaced so i'll start with the 400 then finish with the 600 before applying the clear coat and we will be good to go Guys, so I just want to make a little note if you are ever doing these kind of Highlanders you want to make sure you do this little side right here very easy to overlook that can still make a big difference in appearance after you restore it you definitely want to make sure that you get that spot right there obviously you can't get the whole entire thing but are using tools this is one of those situations where you will have to hand sand because you can't really get a tool in there uh all right so now we're going to move on to the 600 
guys. So I had told the customer to park the vehicle directly facing the sun. Anytime you have that opportunity, definitely take it. That way it'll reduce any, that way it'll reduce the odds of having any issues with the clear coat. Right, everyone, so I'm actually at the customer's job. So anytime you have situations like this, it's not a bad idea to ask the customer to park the vehicle facing the sun. That way, whenever you spray the clear coat, you won't have any issues with it drying. And it just reduces the, the chances of any issues. So. This is one long headlight.